Hello everyone, it's Dave Taylor at Cyberhost Pro with today's tutorial, helping UK business get the best from the web. And today I want to talk to you about local search results. Now, if you're a business that relies on geography, then you're going to be very interested in this. Now, here's, an, here's a search on Google for the term dog training. Okay. And as you can see in this case, what you have is the sponsored advertisements at the top and then you have a series of individual businesses with their addresses and phone numbers and then underneath that you have what are the natural or organic search listing results but in this kind of case uh, Google feels that somebody searching for the term dog training is looking for a local provider and that's why it gives you these kind of results uh, which is called localized search now what you're probably wondering is how come Fido dog training club here is in first place and how come these businesses here are listed on page one of this result but there's a whole lot of other businesses, if you follow this link at the bottom here, uh, a lot of other dog training businesses who are not on page one of Google. So how do these guys get on page one of Google? Well, the first thing that you need to understand is this. You need to get your business name, address, phone number, category, location, and industry listed in lots of different places on the web. That's what Google uses to rank these localized search results. So what does that look like in reality? Well, the first place you wanna go is Google Plus, Google Social Network. And you wanna set up a page for your business. Uh, first of all, you set up a personal profile for your se yourself. And then you, from there, you go to the more icon and you can set up a page and on this page you will be able to enter information such as phone number address uh, email your a live link to your website etc this is really important in terms of ensuring that your uh, things like your business name your address phone number and industry is listed not only in google plus but lots of other places across the web. Now, a couple that I'll um, suggest to you here. The first one that I've had success with is a directory called Hot Frog. And that's what it looks like. So you want to get those details consistently into directories like Hot Frog. Another one that I use is free index and that's what free index looks like both of these are considered by Google to be high value high relevance and uh, trustworthy so you want to get your business in there the other thing that you want to do is to get your business again your business name address phone number uh, mentioned on high value high authority websites uh, get people talking about you so if somebody uh, for example blogs about about your company you want to ensure that they include uh, details of your uh, business name address and phone number in the blog and the more links that Google can see around the web that include that consistent information about your business, the more likely that you will get to the top of these listings here. There is another um, issue, however, and that's this one you can see I've highlighted. That's reviews. The more reviews that you get of your business uh, and the better those reviews are, the higher you will rank, of course, Google is going to look at those reviews and if they're positive or good reviews uh, for dog training, they then Google's going to feel um, happy about um, uh, recommending that dog training business to whoever's looking for dog training because they've got lots of good reviews. 
So if you haven't started asking your customers to review you on Google+, Plus, uh, on your business page on Google+, Plus, now is the time to get going with it. So those are some tips and tricks to get yourself listed on a local search result on Google. So good luck with that, and we'll see you next time with another video tutorial from Cyberhost Pro. Bye for now.